What's going on, everyone, and welcome to another video. Ich heiße Baus Phoenix und heute, uh, I'm sorry. I'm actually a robot, and someone switched my voice filter. That won't happen again. Anyways, I hope you all are having a wonderful weekend. I decided to make this video because a ton of you have been asking what color schemes I use for my Warframes. Well, buckle up, children. I'm about to expose myself. Uh, wait. <laughs> So as most of you veteran players know, Fashion Frames is the penultimate achievement in Warframe. It's pretty much in-game as far as we're concerned, and looking good is just as important as playing good to some people. Those of you that know me well know that I'm one of those people. I've been cultivating accessories, color schemes, and various Warframe skins over the course of my two years of playing, and I've actually amassed quite the collection. In this video, I'd like to show you guys my typical go-to color scheme for most of my Warframes. To start, you'll need several color palettes. These include the Ice, Classic Saturated, and Smoke palettes. If you don't already have it, you should definitely pick up at least the Classic Saturated palette. It's got tons of variety, and it's probably the most versatile color pack you can get. Now, I don't use these colors on all of my Warframes, but as you can see, I use them on the vast majority of them. When coloring my frames, I usually start with this color from the Ice Blue color pack. I've actually dubbed this color Bows Phoenix Blue because of the colors in my logo. See how they kind of match up? I'll typically use this color for most of the color slots on the Warframe. Occasionally, I'll use different shades of it for depth. Next up, I usually like to throw on black into the accents or tertiary colors slot for an accent to the color scheme and to really make the blue colors pop out. If I'm working with a primed Warframe and they've received the PBR treatment that allows you to change the color of the gold parts, I'll either leave it gold or change it to this really awesome burn orange color I've been using a lot lately. That color comes from the classic saturated color pack. If the Warframe isn't primed, I usually just go with a white or light gray in place of the orange. A good example of this is my Wukong color scheme. For most Warframes, this formula works pretty well. Occasionally, I'll run into a Warframe that looks kinda goofy with these colors, or they look weird in different places. If that happens, I usually just invert the colors, which creates sort of a photo-negative effect. For instance, my Ash Prime looks super weird with the blue color in the primary slot, so I made him primarily black with some blue and orange as accents. It doesn't seem like a whole lot of color, but when you add the right accessories, it seems like there's a lot more color than there is. As far as accessories and attachments as they're called go, there are tons of them in this game. If you're new and you've only got a little bit of platinum to spend, I highly recommend picking up either the Daedalus or Eos set. Either one of those sets will go really well with just about any Warframe. After you've gotten those, feel free to pick up some more specialized cosmetics. If I had to sum up cosmetics into a nice little starter pack for you guys, I'd say grab Color Pack Alpha, an armor bundle of your choice, and one of the capes. This will give you a pretty good base of cosmetics to start customizing your gear with, and will cost you a little under 500 platinum. Also, it's important to remember that cosmetics, aside from arcane helmets, don't really do anything for your stats. They're just there to make you look cool, nothing else. And that about does it for today, guys. If you enjoyed this video or maybe learned something new, support it by hitting that like button. It helps out a lot. If you're new here, consider subscribing to the channel. It's free, and it helps more than you can imagine. Lastly, if you'd like to see any of my color schemes in better detail, check out the Fashion Frames page on my website, bowsphoenix.com, and there's a link in the description below for that. But I'll see you guys in the next video, and as always, thank you so much for watching.